keeps locking down the truth is Mar with, Mar blah, 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 with Marcy Locke. <laughs> awesome. Um, so this morning, this one is for the ladies. This is gonna show up and come up for you and you get to look at what perception you have. You know, this morning I, I hit the gym um, and I put myself in this little space where I was gonna kick some trash. And so I threw on my, my weight vest, I took off my shirt, I threw on some, my weight vest so that I could be doing like some plyo hops and some different crazy stuff that, uh, you know, just felt like awesomeness today. And um, this guy comes up to me and he just does this little like look down and standing right there just eh, and he goes, you're hot. And I was like, awesome, thanks. You know, and just like turned around and walked off and was like, that, that was great. Um, and it, every single time this happens, it makes me laugh at how the thought in the past would have been like, you know, weirded out or, um, you know, keeping myself in, in the thought of like, you know, ooh, or, or so we have so many attachments to, um, de and depending on the person that does it, how it triggers you or not. Cause I mean, if it was, you know, some, you know, elaborate person that you would have had a, an issue with, you'd been like, ah, oh, thanks. That's awesome. But I come to the gym to kick ass, like not to, uh, to socialize and, uh, have conversations and usually my head's down so that I can do that. It's also drives me nuts to watch people work out because most of the time they're just throwing their joints into it and they're wasting their, their time. And, and so, um, it's like, I stay focused on, on my creation. Cause it's like, I just want to help everybody not waste their, their, their time. But, um, the point is that instead of me taking this on as, um, you know, weirded out or gross or, um, any story that's not going to work for me, I literally see it now as just validation that yes, I am a hot ass goddess who knows my power and my truth. I'm aligned with my body as my tool to show up and seize life and have energy. And that, yeah, it's just like, yep, thank you. And that's it. And I don't have to attach anything else to it or um, worry or fear or weird it out or anything else that I would have done in the past actually makes you have this unconscious association that you're unsafe or you're, you know, there's even, I've worked with so many individuals that being married, they, they think that there's this fear of if they have a good body, then they're going to cheat or they're going to draw negative attention or so many stories that we tell ourselves internally. And for me, I experienced rape attempts, kidnapping attempts, a stalker when I was younger, um, a, a lot of things that made me believe that the world was an unsafe place and scary. And yet is why I would never allow myself to get to the space where I was shredded and totally healthy and in tune with the body that is the ultimate body of health for me to allow myself to show up in ultimate success and allow myself to show up as the ultimate tool in God's hands because there was a deep unconscious fear of those things that that made me afraid that that was um, it was going to draw that into me or looking for that evidence. So now when that, that evidence just shows up, it's not the same evidence. It's just pure evidence that Yep, I'm a, I'm a goddess of truth and I deserve to have an awesome body and thank you and I just take it as a compliment and, and uh, um, go about my business. So the, the, um, the thing that I want you to get clear on is what do you want as your experience in life and is it consciously really true that you're unsafe or um, that you're in danger or it, that you're going to cheat or any of these things, this thought that you've been telling yourself when it's actually more consciously true that you're more empowered to be healthy and strong or to be protective of yourself to to be a, a tool it, who you know people pray if it's, if it's that you're gonna prey on the weak are you weak seriously consciously thinking about it are you more weak and more of a target when you're living in a body of health and strong and you're confident and you know who you are or are you more of a target when you're huh, scared un, uh, you know self-conscious in fear and literally that's what you're bringing on so um, just a quick thought is to uh, now choose when anything like this shows up if there's people giving you a look down or or um, or any of that shows up, choose the thought that you want. Choose the one that serves you and supports you to say, oh yeah, fuck yeah, I'm a goddess of uh, strength and power and thank you for the acknowledgement. I'll see it only as a compliment. It's just a compliment. It's just feedback that they're saying, damn, you're a, you're a goddess of truth. And you're like, yeah, fuck yeah, I am. Thank you. Awesomeness. This is Marcy Locke. My name is Pat. Choose yours. Choose your best life. Lock it down.